Welcome back, and you're watching Lyft. So Lyft is actually a DIY segment standing for Look, I Finish This. So every segment will be creating something new and exciting related to K-pop or making something relate to K-pop. And on this week's episode, we'll be making a special concert bag for the BTS Wings Final in Seoul. So not only am I going to teach you how to make a really, really cute BTS bag, I'm also going to be telling you the essentials you need to bring for this concert. So before we get started, let's grab our hot chocolate, because it's cold outside, and let's get started. So I want to make this as simple as possible. So I'm going to buy a already made bag um, for the inside so I don't actually have to buy structural support for the red. Uh, I'm going to buy some red fabric for the heart, blue and yellow fabric, some black thread so I can sew the eyes on. And then I also want it to be not just so straight, I actually want it to be more maybe like a pillow kind of, kind of look so it's really squishy. So I'm actually going to buy some padding so I can sew it into the actual bag itself so it kind of like is almost like plushing. Anyways, hopefully it turns out good. Let's go shopping! So the store that I went to is called Daiso. It's kind of like a dollar store. It has a little bit of everything. Prices range from $5 and below. So it's really nice to go to for doing little knickknacks or little projects that you don't want to spend too much money on. So this is the section we are looking for. At my store it's a bit small because I do live in a smaller city, but in other stores you can find a bigger DIY slash fabric making stuff. <laughs> I did also get some stuff in the like hardware because that's where they had the fabric glue. So let's take a look at everything we bought. So the total of this actually cost 10,000 won, which is about $10. I got a red Christmas Santa bag, a blue micro cleaning cloth, some yellow felt, fabric glue, a purse, needles, and of course, thread. Okay, so first thing you wanna do is you wanna turn on some BTS music because this is going to be a long process. So what I did is I took my purse and I sketched it out on my fabric and then sketched out uh, Tata's shape for his head and then we just went ahead and sewed the corners making sure not to um, sew the top for the top of the purse and as you can tell I actually left about two centimeters of extra room just in case I messed up so I had some extra leeway when I was sewing so this is the edges of the first side that I did it's not very good but honestly I'm not a professional at all my second side did come out a lot better. I did mess up a little bit because I was lazy, but overall I'm very happy with how it is so far. When I turned it inside out, it looked so good. I was very happy with it. So I just sketched out Tata's body, and what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to sew around it, giving me some room, just in case I mess up. And remember guys, it's not about making everything perfect. It's about having fun and showing your creativity. So make sure you enjoy what you're doing, and even if it doesn't come out perfectly, just remember you had fun doing it. So as you can see, I finished the outline of his body. Well, maybe you can't, because I was kind of crazy to use the same color of thread as a fabric. Next time, definitely use a different color, because it's so much easier to see. So now we're going to actually cut this out and see how it looks. Oh my gosh, it's so cute! So I think everything is coming together really nicely and now all we have to do is sew the edges one more time but this time do a really good job because this is going to be flipped inside out and it's going to be hanging from the bag so you really want it to be secure. So this time I actually used black thread so it was easy to see. As you can tell I actually did it all the way around and now what we have to do is actually just turn it inside out and then get ready to Put it on to the Tata head after you fill it with stuffing. 
So with it turned inside out, now you just have to figure out which side you want it to be the front of the body. So I like this side. So here's our face, our main bag. And I've actually already put the face on with fabric glue and felt. So it wasn't really very hard. I just cut the shapes out and glued it on. And now we have our Tata body, which is actually not have any felt yet, but I want to test it to see how it looks. And so far, I really, really like it. I think it's super cute, and I can't wait to finish it. So as you're making the bag, I just want to give you a little tip that I've learned, that if you're going to buy a bag and put the character around it, instead of using fabric glue or even sewing it in, I recommend using a hot glue gun to do that. It makes it much easier and very fast. So this is our finished Tata bag. Super cute, giant head little body nice little opening for the purse you can stick lots of stuff in it that's it it goes with everything now you're finished with your bag and you're ready to pack for the concert so let's fill this little baby up so probably the most important thing to remember to bring for any concert is the light stick and since we're doing going to bts i'm taking the army bomb yes i have version two if you don't have one, you can always buy it at the concert. They do have an express line, so you'll be able to get it a little bit quicker than the merchandise. So you're going to need a lot of hot packs. So I have a few different kinds here. So I have a few of these green ones, and these green ones are uh, beyond temperature hot and hot. They actually last for 20 hours. So I'm really excited to try these. I've never tried them before, but I got two because I'm going for two separate days. And so hopefully they do wonders. Next, I have something that I just recently saw. It was actually at Daiso. And I said, why not? I'm going to try it. Since I am going to uh, stand in line for merch, I'm bringing a chair. And this is actually a hot uh, pack for the chair that you actually sit on. So I'm really excited. There's one. It lasts for 12 hours. So I'm really excited to try this out. And last but not least, these are hot packs. Same hot and hot and they're actually for your shoes. So you put them in so your toes don't get all cold. So our last thing that we're going to be putting for, for heat and warmth is actually a little blanket. You want something small enough that fits in your bag, but also something that is like soft and very warm um, to keep you warm through this time. Especially it is December and in Korea it is really cold. It has started to snow already. So what is actually really cool about this blanket it's a lap blanket, but it's also um, has a heating pad in it. So you plug it in to your USB um, external battery and it actually heats up and it works awesome. So I'm so excited to use this this year. Now that you're all nice and warm and cozy while waiting in line, what are you gonna do? Of course, you're gonna be with other members of your fan club. So that means your army. So why not bring a Bluetooth speaker so you guys can listen to music together. So the next thing that you have you should always bring is your, your external batteries. These are really important. Not only are you going to be using your phone a lot for taking pictures, you listening to music, finding your friends. So if your phone dies, you have lost the war. So being a foreigner in Korea I, that goes to concerts, I like to bring candy with me just because it's a nice little icebreaker and a little nice little gesture when you meet new people. So finally, the last thing I like to pack in my concert bag is always a little um, personal stuff. So make sure you bring like chapstick, bring a little medical cabinet kit. I got this little um, case um, at Daiso for like a dollar, um, but it has a Band-Aids, Q-tips, a Tylenol, Ibuprofen, just a little stuff for a little everyday things, Band-Aids. Just in case something does happen, you have it right um, handy right away. So that concludes our very first episode of Lift. I hope you learned a little something about the DIY project. I know I did. And I hope you can create something yourself. It doesn't have to be the same character as I did, but go ahead and use your imagination and let it run wild. Also, I hope you learned a little bit about what you should bring in your concert bag. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button down below. Also, if you can do this project, which character would you choose? It doesn't have to be a BT21 character. It could be from Hip Hop Monster or actually from any other fandom as well. And if you can put something into your concert bag that I didn't mention, what would you bring? So I'm really excited to hear what your guys' responses are. So make sure you subscribe to this channel because we'll be reading all these comments. And I'll see you next time.
Look, I finished this. See you at the concert.